supposedly invented in the USA by director William Ashett, who developed the hit show Isle of Lucy. The situation comedy has been a genre which has endured on our screens since the 1950s. As a widely watched populist medium, it could be argued that the sitcom is a great indicator for the issues circulated within the public sphere and the wider societal attitudes towards them. This week we will look at Jürgen Habermas's idea of the public sphere and see how the media that we engage with shapes it. We will debate if the theory is still relevant today and examine if there is anything which can actually be considered normative within the 21st century. With the increasingly fractured nature of viewing habits, is it that we no longer have enough common reference points to be able to effectively engage in a space where differing opinions are able to be expressed and understood? Could it be that today's society must appear to be post-ideological and therefore the public sphere is now one of cynicism, where there is no ideological truth remaining? Or is it that the idea of the public sphere has evolved since its first inception and now means something else entirely? Afterwards, we will look at the groundbreaking sitcom series Community, created by the maverick writer Dan Harmon, and examine if the TV that he brought to our screens is an extension of Breck's epic theatre productions. Is it that sitcoms can make us smarter? Or is it that they are as hollow as the laugh track which accompanies them? <laughs>